Hi, I'm Bill Vornick, and I'm a picky son of a b um, I got a chance to try this microphone, the C5. And um, I was doing a, a session, this very historic session. It'll be out in spring of 2010 um, with the leading musicians in Nashville. Um, and I tried this on a guitar and a mandolin. And I'm a KM84 freak. And this puppy right here is what I would choose now. Uh, Mike contacted me uh, about six months ago about uh, some new microphone, a new microphone line that he was developing, and uh, I was I thought, yeah, bring him on, Mike. Love to hear him. Yeah, so he brought over uh, a C5, a small diaphragm uh, end address uh, microphone. Here it is, right here, and uh, we listened to it, uh, put it on acoustic guitar. Uh, 1950 J45, and uh, thought it sounded great. Thought it sounded really good, and so we A B'd it to this microphone here, which is a Sh Shep CM65 tube microphone, which is kind of my favorite mic, my favorite acoustic instrument mic. I prefer this over the KM series uh, Telefunkens, the KM54s, 64s. It's richer, fuller. It's got more. Uh, depth to it, more three-dimensionality. Um, well, we tried this microphone. I was going to add an extra guitar part to, uh, uh, like a, a brighter guitar part to go along with the part that I recorded with this. And we, we did that, and this mic actually sounded too good. And it was too full and too rich. So uh, in other words, it was doing almost the same thing this mic did. And so then when we got to A, B, and the mics recording the same thing again, it was almost like we couldn't tell the difference between the Sheps and the C5, which kind of blew my mind, because I've never heard a microphone to even come close to this. So the C5 is, in my opinion, the best microphone I've, I've ever heard for an end address small diaphragm capsule um, to come close to my Sheps. Hi, I'm recording engineer, producer, and artist Richie Owens coming to you from the Marathon Recorders in Nashville, Tennessee. We just finished recording a truly historic CD featuring members of the legendary Owens and Part musical families. We used the Mic Tech microphones all over the record. We used the C5s on drums and overheads and hi-hats, and they sounded great. We also used the C5s on the acoustic guitar, and the results are truly amazing. The C5 captured not only a true sound, but it was amazingly fat sounding.